And if you're already making plans for the next tech game, we've got a tune-up for your tailgate. Sweet and spicy pulled pork tacos, good enough to leave burgers and dogs in the dust. For the recipe, we go into Cat's Kitchen. Hey guys, today we're making something for a perfect TV tailgate party. Something you can eat on your couch. We're making pulled pork tacos with a spicy sweet sauce. We want to get started with our pork. This takes a long time to cook. About five hours, even in a crock pot. We're going to start off by just making sure that our pork is nice and dry before we season it. We want our seasonings to stick right onto that. And for our seasonings, we're going to use one tablespoon of chili powder, half a tablespoon of paprika, half a tablespoon of onion powder, and half a tablespoon of garlic. It's a lot, I know, but it's going to make this very flavorful. Just want to kind of make sure that you get this all incorporated, get, get it all mixed together. There we go. We're going to put our pork in, and you want to season both sides of this, this. So we're going to pour about half of our spice mixture onto the top, and you just rub it on in. You want to make sure you get every little nook and cranny. Let's flip it over. Be sure you get the sides too. This looks ready to go. We're going to put it in our 300 degree oven for about five hours. You can do this in a crock pot on high. Once we have our pork cooking, we want to get started on our sauce. We're going to take a tablespoon of butter, get that melted down, and we're going to saute vegetables in it. We have two jalapenos seeded and diced. We have one medium white onion. and three tablespoons of garlic. Stir that around. We're going to wait until these vegetables get kind of soft to add the rest of the ingredients. And when we come back, we're going to finish the sauce and pull our pork. Mm -hmm. You can find this recipe and more at myfoxlovick.com. Back to you guys. All right, thanks so much, Kat. And just like she said, uh, go to My Fox Lobby. It's under the Good Day tab specifically. And we do Kat's Kitchen every Tuesday and Thursday at this time. Oh, so. so yummy. I can't wait to see how it turns out. She gave us a sneak peek.